Today, what we're going to do is we're going to cook burgers in our Bradley smoker using ground prime rib or a rib steak. We've ground it through on a nice coarse setting, taken some smoked cloves of garlic and ground that through as well. A little bit of crispy fried onions, a couple of heaping teaspoons of Dijon mustard, a Worcestershire sire sauce. It's not the easiest word to say, but you can say it however you want. Kosher salt and ground black pepper. There's no rules when it comes to cooking in your backyard. It's your backyard. You can do whatever you want. Now, poke a hole in the center. This is demi glass. This is reduced veal stock. And you poke that right into the center. Now, I tell you, these are not your normal sized burger. You might be saying to yourself, why didn't he flatten those burgers? Well, I don't like flat burgers. Flat burgers have no love. They're not juicy. I'm drooling now, and they're only going into the Bradley smoker. So we've got them on the rack, sitting on the rosemary. Our smoker is set at 250 degrees. Open it up. Smell that mesquite wood. Put it on the middle rack. All right, we're going to put our probe in. We're looking for an internal temperature of 160 degrees. I like a medium burger, which is about 140 to 145 degrees. But to be on the safe side, well done is the way to go. But just at 160. Because we're not going to be squishing these burgers or pushing these burgers, these burgers are going to stay moist and juicy. And that's the great advantage of smoking this burger because you don't have to worry about flare-ups on your grill. You don't have to touch them. You just let them cook naturally. Now, they've been in here about an hour and a half. Look at this. Oh, take that out. I want to show you how evil, evilly delicious these are. You know, you cut into it. You see that demi just starts to ooze out and that burger is just nicely smoked and fully cooked all the way through. This is a mouth-watering, juicy burger. You've never had a burger this juicy and I'm telling you, you serve this to your friends in your backyard that comes out of your Bradley smoker and I tell you, you will be a barbecue hero like you've never been before.